Hello everybody, here we go. One more CNC cut sign that I have to do. Uh, it's almost done. Uh, I just uh, got it today. Uh, the company who painted, they just uh, did a nice job and uh, I just brought it from there. Uh, I went ahead and installed these um, ladders already. Um, I'm right here, I just uh, left one so you guys can see. Uh, when I draw the whole sign, these ladders and everything, what I do is I put them together in, in my computer, I mean in my uh, program and put them together on the top of each other. And then uh, what I do is I go ahead and drill the holes uh, through both of them, which are aligning. And um, I don't have to do the measurements at the end. Um, you can see like holes right there on the bottom. Uh, the one hole right here is for the wire. So if uh, I need to install any LED or anything like that, uh, there's one hole uh, underneath each um, ladder right there. So um, anyway, here we go. The stands, standoff are welded uh, where the holes were. So I don't have to measure. I don't have to worry about measuring at the end or while I'm welding. I know that it's gonna be exact and that's what happened when I put them up. Uh, the other thing I did is that uh, the standoff uh, bolts are, um, I would say quarter inch. So I make these holes a little bigger than that. So that way, if I have to do any adjustment, I have uh, space to do. Um, these pieces, uh, this is one of the eye bottom piece. And what I do is I uh, make a stamp. I put a stamp on it. So um, that way I know which uh, part is this. This is I bottom. It, it says IB in the back. I have to mark it so that way I don't miss it. Miss it. This is not a big of a sign, but uh, sometimes I have a bigger sign where there are so many little things I have to know where they should go. Uh, sometimes they look alike, like for example, this edge, the top and the bottom, they look alike, but they have a slightly different angle or they look a little different when you put them upside down um, all all our all letters are installed and they look so far so good uh, I'm gonna go ahead and install this once I'm done making the video I just wanted to show you what I did I uh, this is aluminum so I found aluminum um, standoffs on Amazon and uh, tack welded them probably both sides are better uh, if you weld on the both sides that's much better i try to weld the whole thing all around but i thought of i don't need to and um welding only at two places uh works really nice so uh this one came out really good uh the painting guys they did a really nice job and uh, i hope uh the customer likes it so far so good if you have any question let me know um but i think uh i'm gonna go ahead and keep doing the way I do it right now uh, there's uh, no other way I found that's really easy beside this for me I know there are so many other ways you can make signs different ways for me I found this way is better uh, the other question is how I hang it what I do is I go ahead and make a cleat you can see right there it's already welded in the back with the little space um, the two pieces one over here and one all the way on the other side. And I'm gonna go ahead and make the other cleat, half of it, which is gonna be carbon steel. And that's gonna be on the wall installed where I'm gonna go ahead and install it. I can install it into two by fours. If I don't have the two by fours nearby, I can go ahead and install it where I can, uh, as long as it's not out of the sign. And I can adjust the sign left or, left or right um you know whichever i want uh, i love the cleat idea because if you put it uh, solid you won't be able to move it if you have to uh in the future it'd be hard to take it off or install it back the cleat idea is really good for me uh in my eyes because it, it works really good for me uh okay guys so that's what it is if you have any question let me know came out really nice all right